Hello, my name is Rachel Harris. I was born and raised in Topeka, Kansas, but I currently reside in Manhattan, Kansas, where I've been for the past 11 years. During this speech, I will explain my past, present, and future using meaningful objects that represent these three stages of my life. My past has shaped me into the person I am today. My present self allows me to mold my future to what I wish it to be, while my future beckons the realization of those dreams and goals closest to my heart. The first item I will be sharing with you today is from my past. It's my cosmetology school t-shirt. This represents a challenging decision I had to make to forego traditional college and pursue my passion of hairstyling. Hair and beauty have been a passion of mine for as long as I can remember. For the past 11 years, I have been living my dream, working as a hairstylist and achieving numerous milestones along the way, such as being nominated by my coworkers as best colorist and hair cutter for the past two years running, along with being named highest producer in the salon in 2015. While I am lucky enough to hold a job that I truly love, I am undoubtedly ready to pursue new avenues and challenges within the industry. This leads me to my present. The object that most notably describes my present are my marketing and business books. Um, I've chosen these two books because they best represent my current goals and aspirations. I'm currently working towards an associate's and arts degree in marketing. Once I have achieved this goal, I plan to transfer to Kansas State University and attain my bachelor's in business administration. The achievement of these goals only further me in the pursuit of my future goals. These present goals represent the fuel and foundation that will allow me to achieve the future I envision for myself. My final item, the item of the future, is the cover page of the marketing plan for my very own salon. Um, although everything about this plan is hypothetical, it represents my long-term goal to open a salon where stylists can learn and grow and clients can be comfortable and confident in the service they are receiving. Hair and beauty will forever be my passion, but the constant strain on my body will one day make it difficult for me to perform my job. By opening my own salon, I will be able to work within the industry that I'm most passionate about, as well as help other stylists see and reach their true potential. I would like to leave you with a quote that has helped me maintain a strong focus through tough times. As someone who suffers from anxiety, I use this quote to help quiet the doubts and chatter in my mind. I use it to remind myself that I can achieve anything in life by allowing myself to recognize what is truly important, the ability to believe in oneself. This quote is from famous poet Ralph Waldo Emerson. What lies behind us and what lies before us are tiny matters compared to what lies within us. Thank you.